Hello Big Pete fans, it is day four of our American road trip and we have left the hotel and we are moving away from where the Hall of Fame is uh, and we've got some plans, we're going to go to a museum and see some unique vehicles we're just calling into a lovely local diner which is just screams Middle America to us so let's see what today brings what do you say, Michael? It looks busy. It doesn't look any busier than when we last came. Okay. He's concerned he ain't gonna get his eggs and bacon. So we've just parked up here at the National Auto Truck Museum, Auburn, Indiana, which is not far from all of it. And we have kidnapped again, the uh, V8 Ford man, again, from the museum. But whilst we are in the car park, This is our trusty steed for the week. One the, point, the, one point six the I'm, I'm going to use Andy for scale. Normally you use a Coke can, don't you? So that is Andy to scale. Oh, and there's Michael to scale. But most importantly, we've had to see what we've got under the hood. He's got an LS. And we're all very happy to see. It's definitely not a one liter eco boost. It's an LS, which makes the Chevy boys very happy. Michael to scale. I think I think Andy wins on sitting in things. Are you making brum brum noises, Andy? Yeah. Look at this. This is called a future liner. Yeah. <laughs> When Colton watches this, he's going to be super jealous. He's giving us access to have a look inside. So it was made by General Motors as a promotional vehicle. It would tour from town to town uh, doing a thing called the Parade of Progress. So there'll be half a dozen or a dozen of these that will pull into town. But what's really cool is these white walls, the cute little atomic symbol, but it'll be upside down on this. It has the Parade of Progress logo molded into the tire. It's like a train. This is what they used to do, pull up into towns like this. With all the future liners, as they're called. With all various displays inside. What a wild and weird vehicle this is. It's massive, you can't really get an idea of size. This is the engine bay underneath the cab. So you got to says you got to lie lie on the wheel arch to do all the work, and then obviously that's where the steps are that we go upside. It says it's very top ever. So this is inside a future liner. It's got relieves driver's seats, some sort of uh, pop top. Which is held down with bungee cords, I'm guessing the mechanism's not so great. Uh, out the front, the view, the pedal, the main driver's seat. 140 horsepower. This is all it had in them days to move such a beam off of the thing. This is one of the most unique driving positions ever seen with the curved glass but you can just see the top of dad and Don who's given us the opportunity to look in and Michael so it's 
The visibility is not too dissimilar from being in Big Pete. <laughs> So in the same museum where the future liner is, is this, a record breaking diesel truck. Now if you followed the history, dad, just there, started off doing record breaking runs in trucks. Uh, originally diesel powered before jet engines. So he's, he's like a little boy. So we're just going for our main meal now and we have inherited slash kidnapped Mike Welsh. Hey, having fun. Loving this out here with you guys. Just awesome. Continue yeah. the party. <laughs> you guys are teaching me a lot of things, a lot of special words. Hopefully I remember <laughs> them all. And, uh, you guys are awesome, man. Thanks, Mike. We've kidnapped him from the Hall of Fame for our English friends who probably don't realize. Mike Welsh is an inductee into the Hall of Fame, full on legend, and he built the Super Pete, which Big Pete is heavily a tribute to, shall we say, influenced by. So he he's seen Big Pete, really digs it. And I did it first, you did it right. <laughs> oh, thank you. He's certainly done a lot of things first. Legend, and he's joining it. Good evening, Big P fans. It is now evening time. I'm in my Batman pyjamas. Um, hope you enjoyed the videos. If you do, like and share and all that jazz. And we'll see what tomorrow brings. And we love you and goodbye.